two-day music festival is expected to draw a crowd of thousands to Boyd County this weekend. Yeah, Rock the Country will feature some really big name artists. Mm -hmm. News Channel 3's Kimberly Keggy is joining us now with what people should expect if they're heading out this weekend. Hey, Kimberly. And hey, Sarah and Tim, well, check out that stage behind me. You can see it there. Crews have been working all day to build that stage from the ground up. Boyd County Tourism saying they're expecting a crowd of around 30,000 people in the area this coming weekend. The road to the Boyd County Fairgrounds when it's not summer peak season is typically pretty quiet. But come this weekend, Rock the Country will transform this venue. It's going to be very, very busy in this area um, starting Thursday through Sunday. The music festival features country music superstars like Jason Aldean, Kid Rock, and Miranda Lambert, just to name a few. On Monday, crews were working around the clock to build the state from the ground up as preps were finalized to handle the traffic. If you're coming in from the 179 exit, they will go down to Technology Drive and go out toward ACTC. There's a road that turns off that will come back down to Addington Road. Those coming in from the Greenup County Inn will turn on to Green Valley Road, make the loop under Addington, and come in that way. That way there's no crossover traffic coming in. All traffic will come in this way and be parked in the, the various parking spots. Boyd County Emergency Management is encouraging people plan ahead because backups are inevitable. Our plea to the public, especially those coming, is to be patient. Um, there's going to be delays. There's no way around it. Um, there's going to be delays both coming in and delays going out. So we ask them to have patience. Oh, we're all going to have to pack our patience this weekend if we're coming to that festival. Some important things to keep in mind, though. Uh, for anyone who's camping in the area, they have made some changes because of the weather that we had the past couple of weeks. Some of the sites that they were planning on having campers at are a little bit. The ground's just a little bit too mushy and wet there. So, uh, you know, just watch out for an email about those changes. And reminder, if you are camping this weekend, trailers, RVs, those are only going to be allowed on the roads on Thursday. All of those people that are camping will have to be on site by then. That's because they're trying to help alleviate just a little bit of that expected congestion. You can see somebody maybe just pulled in right behind you, Kimberly, and there's lots of activity in the background. Thank you. That festival set to be on Friday, April 19th.